Hey everyone, it's Kaylee here from Microsurvey, and in today's video, I'm going to show you a cool and useful feature in our latest release, Survey Tools for Bricks CAD. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the quad. Okay, so the quad is a tool that pops up in the workspace as a cursor. Um, and this tool gives you instant access to relevant and frequently used tools, commands that depend on whatever you're hovering over. So to use the quad, first I want to make sure that it's activated. I do this by going to the quad tab that is right here on the bottom right hand corner of the screen. Um, so I have it activated here. So if you click on an empty area of your drawing, the quad launches in what is called the no selection mode and gives you some options to get started in your drawing. So the icons that you see here along the top are the most commonly used tools. And then if you expand the bottom categories, the quad is going to suggest some relevant options to what you're doing. Simply select on what you need and then the quad will launch the command. Okay, so I have my quad activated. Now we're going to see how it reacts with some of the commonly used microsurvey tools. Okay, so if I hover over my smart point, the first thing that pops up tells me what the object is, what layer it's on, the name of it, and the color. So before we even get into the quad, this is a really cool feature in that you can just change the color, change the layer, or the name right here exactly where you're working you don't have to click on the object and then go over to the properties menu and change it from there so that's a time saver in and of itself right there um, then when i click on this button here this activates the quad functionality down here if i open up these categories we have modify select insert general and then there's a special one here for smart points because it is a smart point that pops up here on the side so we have move point label, move point label with leader, and rotate point label, and then reset the point label. So let's try with the leader and see uh, what we can do. So I'm going to click on it. It pops in the leader, and it allows me to kind of manipulate that however I want. So let's put it up here, and then enter to exit out of the command. And if I want to do that again, it's the first or the last one used is the first one that pops up in the quad but I'm gonna go back there and let's try under smart points to rotate my labels so I'm going to select that and that allows me to let's crank it around like this and then let's do number four let's crank that around like that just to show the juxtaposition so that's that for now now say, okay, that totally doesn't look right. I can go back to smart points and reset my label, click on the block, and it will bring it right back to normal. So super quick and easy customization with your labels right there available in the quad. And then you can see that same customization is going to be available um, with your uh, lot lines. So we've got bearings and distances on all of our lot lines. We can change the color. I'm going to make this one yellow. We can change the text height. So let's say I want to make my distance pop. I'm going to make that 0.25. So another thing that I did with my lines that I drew up in here was create a simple surface. So I'm going to quickly turn that on now. So here we go. Now when I hover over that, some of the options that the quad gives me is adding boundaries, adding break lines, adding points, adding lines, removing points, deleting lines. Um, again, very quick and easy access to these tools. Instead of having to go up to the ribbon and try to find what you're looking for, it's all right there at your fingertips. All right, everyone, that is it for this video. I didn't intend to get super deep with any of the technical workflow. I just wanted to quickly graze over the quad tool and show you how useful and efficient that that could be in your day-to-day -day working. Um, so I hope you thought it was cool. I thought it was cool. And I hope that you are signed up for your free demo of Survey Tools for Bricks CAD. Thanks for watching.